Hello dear students, today we are going to start with addition, subtraction and multiplication and division of binary arithmetic. Binary arithmetic is what? Like arithmetic means to, to addition, subtraction, multiplication and division and binary means arithmetic of binary numbers which are in the form of zeros and ones. Right? So the first operation is binary addition then is subtraction then is binary multiplication and then is division so we are going to start with binary addition we have already done this in our class also so binary addition in a binary addition 0 plus 0 is equal to 0 these are the rules of addition 0 plus 1 is 1 1 plus 0 is 1 and 1 plus 1 is equal to 0 with the carry 1 1 plus 1 becomes 0 with carry 1 and whenever we are adding these three ones, 1 plus 1 is 0 with carry 1, right? Then this carry will be further added to its result is 0 with carry, carry is equal to 1. But whenever we are adding another one to this result, this 1 and this previous addition result 0 will become 1 and again we have a carry 1. So in 1 plus 1 plus 1, the result is 1 with the carry 1 and in 1 plus 1 also we have this carry 1 but the result will be 0. Then whenever we are adding two numbers, suppose two numbers are 9 and 11. So whenever these will be added we will get 20 but how this will be done in binary is that 9 will be converted into binary which will become 1 0 0 1. 11 will be converted into binary which will become 1 0 1 1. Now, by using these rules, we will be adding these two binary numbers. 1 plus 1 is 1 plus 1 is 0. Carry is 1. Whatever the carry is, we will write down this carry on the top of the above digits to use this carry for further addition. So, next is these three terms to be added. 1 plus 0 is 1. 1 plus 1 is addition is 1, oh, sorry addition is 0 and the result of this is sum is 0, addition is 0 and the carry is 1 which we will write here on next binary numbers. Then 1 plus 0 is 1, 1 plus 0 is 1, so this result is 1. Then moving on to 1 plus 1 is 0 and the carry is 1. Now we do not have any further bits in this addition so this one will be attached at the end of this addition result so this whole result will become 10100 now we will be considering these whole bits as the result of our addition so 10100 will become 20 in decimal number now if we, sometimes we will see that we have four bits and in addition also we will be having four bits and this will uh, the carry for next bit so we will not use it no in addition the carry in the end of the addition will be retained with the bits of the result so end carry this carry here in addition will be treated as binary number of the result so the result will be 20 so we can check this out also by using the decimal number then moving on to subtraction in subtraction we have different methods of subtraction first of all we will be discussing and we will be doing the basic method of subtraction which we have already done so rules of subtraction are 0 minus 0 is equal to 0 1 minus 0 is equal to 1 0 minus 1 is it will be equal to 1 with borrow 1 as we use carry in addition, we use borrow in subtraction. As we cannot subtract 0 from 1 because 1 is greater than 0. So we will take borrow from next bit. So that borrow will become 1. So the result of subtraction is 1 and borrow's value will be equal to 1. Whereas in other terms, the, uh, the in these rules, the value of borrow will be equal to 0 only. Next is 1 minus 1 will be equal to 0 and the borrow will also be equal to 0. Now we have two terms 0, 0, 1, 1 and 1, 1, 0, 0. It is saying that subtract this 0, 0, 1, 1 from 1, 1, 0, 0. It means this will be written at the top. 
सो वन वन जीरो जीरो वन वन जीरो जीरो एंड वी नीड टू सब्ट्रैक्ट जीरो जीरो वन वन फ्रॉम दिस सो वील राइट जीरो जीरो वन वन एंड वी विल परफॉर्म दिस सब्ट्रैक्शन नाउ यूजिंग दिज रूल्स द सब्ट्रैक्शन इज जीरो माइनस वन विल बी इक्वल टू वन विद द बोरो जीरो माइनस वन विल बी इक्वल टू वन विद बोरो वन नाउ फ्रॉम वेयर दिस बोरो विल बी टेकन In this subtraction, the borrow will be taken from the next digit, but this digit is again zero. So this digit will borrow from its next digit, which is one. So we will be borrowing from this one, and this one will come here, right? So this will become one zero. One zero in decimal is two. Two minus one is one, and this will. What it will do is this will make it. This borrow will be written here. So next is one minus one will be equal to zero as one minus one will be equal to zero. Then one minus zero is equal to zero and one minus zero is equal to one. So the result of this subtraction is one zero zero one. Now we can check from this uh, by converting this decimal number to uh, sorry this binary number to decimal. How check it out that twelve is one one zero zero. And three is zero zero one one. <clears throat> the result should be equal to nine. So this is one zero zero one is equal to nine, right? So our subtraction process is all right. So this was the subtraction by using these simple rules. But we have two more method for subtraction which are more easier and they are frequently asked in the question paper. Those subtraction method will be discussed in the next video.